The process for an OVI is, or a DUI is a lot more complicated than most people think. It's not like a traffic ticket, it's an actual criminal case. So you can't go in and plead no contest and say, judge, hey, these are the facts. I'm really not guilty, I wasn't drunk. If you go in and plead no contest or guilty, you're most likely going to jail or some form of uh, incarceration, whether it's a three-day program over the weekend. Most people don't even realize that. You're losing your license for at least a year if you go in the first day and try to throw yourself on the mercy of the court. And we see people make that mistake all the time. One of the first things we do after we get all of our filings into the court is we, we file a notice to preserve evidence. And what that is, is it's pretty much putting the state on notice that whatever you have, you have to keep. And that, that's one of the most important things in these cases because a lot of the time we see videos disappear, body cams disappear, and if we don't have that notice in, then it's as if it didn't exist. Now when we get that notice in, that means it's presumed to have existed and it's presumed to be in our favor. So if it disappears, that's going to be helpful for us. So one of the most important things is making sure we preserve the record, really. So that's what we're doing in all of our cases. So after we file our notice to preserve, we'll file our discovery demand, and that's our request for evidence from the state. They need to turn over the dash cam, they need to turn over the body cam, the booking video, the breath test, the police report, all the, the different things we're looking for so that we can put together a defense. And it takes time. It can take you know three, four, five, six months in some courts to get that done. Other courts move quickly, but we prefer to move at whatever speed's necessary for the client. I would say a lot of our OVI cases either resolve with a reduction or we set them for trial. Sometimes right away, you know, with a certain prosecutor, they might say, well, this is a very low test. It's Patitus and Associates, let's resolve this. 